Hi, Happy Scrap Girl here. Welcome to this video tutorial on how to rotate and scale a pattern in Adobe Illustrator. As you can see, I've created this triangle pattern that I want to have repeat over a 12 by 12 page. Um, so what I'm going to do is select my pattern and drag it over to the swatches box. Then I'm going to make a new layer. Draw a rectangle. I'm sorry, square. It's 12 by 12 over my artboard. And I'm going to take off the stroke. And on the fill, I'm going to click on the pattern. Now, I really like this pattern, but it's a little bit too big to go with the um, project I'm working on. And so I want to make the pattern a little bit smaller. If I click on my selection tool and click on the pattern and I grab this little arrow and drag it down, it's just, it'll make the pattern smaller, but it'll also make the area that it covers smaller. And I really want it to be 12 by 12. So instead, what I need to do is right click on the pattern and go to transform and we're going to choose scale. Now uh, I want to do it at 50% smaller and when what it did was it made everything smaller. It made the pattern smaller but it also made the area that it covers smaller and that's not what I want to do. But if I go over to here options and I unclick this objects box it made the pattern smaller, but the area that it covers is still 12 by 12. And you can see it if um, your preview box is checked, you can see that there. Um, so that looks about what I want it to be. So I'm going to click OK. And now I want to rotate it. And again, if I click on it and I drag it to rotate it, it rotates the whole 12 by 12 area, which is, again is not what I want. So instead, I'm going to right click again, transform, and this time I'm going to go to rotate. And um, you'll need to click on the preview button. And again, make sure only the patterns box is checked. And then just put the angle in there that you want. I want it to turn to the right, so I'm going to use minus. Maybe 20% is about, yeah, is about where I want it. I could go a little bit less if I wanted to. Yeah, that looks pretty good to me. Then I'll click OK. And there you have it, a super easy way to rotate and scale your patterns in Adobe Illustrator. Now if you save your pattern file, you can easily use this pattern over again and again at different scales and rotations to create many variations of this paper in just a few minutes. It's a great way to speed up your design process. Thank you so much for watching this video, and if you have any questions, you can contact me at happyscrapgirl at live.com. Have a great day.